like the calm before the break you leave me in the wake of a new Oh, thank you so much for your company this morning. Singer, songwriter and multi-instrumentalist Seth Harper returns from a hiatus with his soulful song, New Wave. Uh, this is the first official single by the Silver Scroll nominee artist since his self-titled debut record, which was released in 2011. Seth, thank you so much for joining us today. Oh, yeah. cool. nice my first back. question, my first question, that is a beautiful video. Thank uh, you. But I'm looking at it going, how'd you get the piano down the beach? <laughs> yes. Well, many hands make light work, so I was really lucky to have an amazing team that I told them my vision and they were like, yes, we can we can execute it. So, so that's yeah. a behind the scenes thing that I think yeah. is so fascinating. Just imagine a whole lot of people clonk, yeah, clonk, 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 dipping into the thing. At the time that just um, carefully carried that piano down to the water. Check the tides, <laughs> make sure you weren't gonna get the piano too wet. Yeah, all those what? things. Um, we were quite lucky actually because as you can see the day was so stunning and I guess the angels were smiling down on us then because things could have potentially <laughs> gone wrong. But <laughs> yeah. The piano could have sank exactly, and then you've got yeah. some beautiful camera shots and they mm. usually sink and sand as well. How did you do that? Um, a drone? I, I think that the sand might, may have settled at that point. Nice. So, yeah. Oh, well, well really done. Good. Looks beautiful. This, <laughs> is, Thank this you. is your first single out for quite a few years, mm. but you've been quietly working away behind the scenes with yes. other people, have you? Yeah. What have you been doing? I love um, the opportunity to work on other people's projects, and so I've been writing, producing and arranging for a number of friends who, I also, who are also artists, um, such as Maisie Dika, um, Stan Walker, and Sons of Zion, and also producing some soundtracks for film and TV. Yeah. It must be nice as a performer yourself watching other musicians shine behind the microphone. Oh, definitely. Um, for me too, it's amazing to be privy to that process of the early creative stage where they are figuring out what messages they want to share with their audience. and. For me, it's really special to, mm. to be a part of that process. Yeah, yeah. That's really, really important honor. for you, isn't it? To, it? to make sure that the message is on par with what you want it to be as well. I think that at the end of the day, we write songs for ourselves, but we also hope that others out there that can connect. And so I think it's important um, from what I've seen that the messages are strong and that they have the film, relatability. The TV stuff that you've done for TV, what goes into the behind the scenes for that? Like, how do you write for a television program or a film? Um, it's great because again it's a collaborative process so I got given um, visuals that didn't have any music and so what I would do is watch and just kind of play songs as um, I was watching them play out on screen and kind of be inspired in that way. And, and it's so important too with TV and films because it can change the whole context of the scene, can't it, the music? Definitely, yeah. I'll be nervous. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think that there is an element of, of being attuned to what the visual is trying to yeah. represent and um, yeah, allowing that to shine through. Okay, so given all of that that you've been doing, because I've known you for a long time, what do you think the difference is between you know, your last single and all this time later your new single? Could you sum that up? Um, I'd say that it's a progression, um, but it's also very true to the music that I was making back then. Right. Um, at the end of the day, I'm a singer-songwriter who plays piano, and so lyric and melody have always been really important to me. Um, though there has been a progression in the sense that I've incorporated more of our traditional Polynesian and Māori instruments in the song and um, for instance there's poi in, in New Wave and the pahu drum which is I guess like a, a bass drum of the Pacific. So there are elements of my identity that are more present in the new material. So what's New Wave actually about, the song? Uh, it's a, For me it's an expression of thanks for even now still being able to create music, um, being able to work with different people. Um, it's really just a simple song about mm. being grateful, to be honest. Yeah. Uh, how old were you when you wrote your first song? Um, I think I was about eight. Can you remember <laughs> it? Uh, yeah, vaguely, but I don't And know. sing it! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, but I remember specifically singing about home, so oh, yeah. uh, there were values even back then mm -hmm. of Fano and family that have still continued. I was reading also that you want to write, you, you really, it's important to you that you write music that brings value. What does that actually mean? Um, I think like what I was saying mm. earlier, um, we write songs to hopefully make a connection with people. Um, I know that when I personally listen to music, I look really for some way to connect to that and it's just, I guess, um, an exercise in connection really. Yeah. Well that, you are uber brings... talented oh, and it's great to you. have a new single from you Seth. Thank Fantastic. You so much. Yeah, great catching up. Thank What's you so much. Yeah. I've been working on a lot of material and hopefully that will form an album 
potentially later on in the year. Um, but also through my journey of connecting with my heritage, I have been really encouraged and inspired to sing in Te Reo Māori, so... Ooh. Excellent. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Hey, it's been an absolute pleasure chatting with you. Cool. Uh, now you can check out Seth Harpo's new single, New Way, via Spotify, iTunes or Apple Music. Mm -hmm.